So I'm at Chateau Carbonneau where I'm going to join other tasters and we're going to taste about 40 wines from the Grave region, red and white. It's a gorgeous chateau. Uh, it's part of the Pessac Léonion appellation just outside of the Léonion village. We are in it, Chateau Carbonneau and this is the tasting room. You can see some lovely tables, very professionally set up. Um, we're doing a blind tasting, so you see that the bottles are numbered. And we all know, uh, because we come here a lot, the journalists who come here regularly, know the wines of Pessac Léonion and the Grave region. Um, so it's not totally blind. We have some idea of what we're tasting, but it's always fun to taste the wines without knowing what they are. Um, but because we get to taste wines at other chateaus non-blind, I like to do a combination. I taste blind, and then I look at what I've tasted, and it's easy sort of to confirm my initial feelings that way. Um, so this is going to be very exciting. We're going to taste a 2012 vintage of the Grave region here at Chateau Carbonio. So you see I'm pouring uh, the wines now in, in glasses. This is wine number five. Uh, no particular order has been determined, so they could be mixing the Southern Grave with the Northern Grave, the Pessac Leonion region. So it makes, makes it quite interesting for tasters to see if they can tell the difference. So Peter, you're, you've been reporting on Bordeaux en Primeur since 1982. Yes, that's right. What, what do you think of the Graves? No, but I like it very much, especially in the small vintages, because uh, in the small vintages, really, they, they show their character. And the, the tannins in the Grave, it's all, always much more smooth than uh, in, in Midoc area. So that's why and, and often they're peaking one week before of the Cabernet Sauvignon, which really is a problem this year. So uh, I really, um, I enjoy them so much. How is it a problem this year? No, I, I, I know. I think it's, it's, it's a wonderful year, and it, I think it's also it will become a year from the restaurants because the price it will not be as as expensive as 2009 and 2010. So I think it's it's, it's, it's a wonderful ambassador for for Bordeaux this year. All right, cheers. <laughs>